But what hung tie comes down just a little bit. Just a little bit. Do we see the beginning of the end right now? You, you, could, you just know. <laughs> I'm just my, it just makes my heart sick. Okay? Look at verse 13. And it came to pass when Lahontai had come down with his guards to Amalekiah. Amalekiah desired him to come down with his army in the nighttime and surround the men of their camps over the land. And if he, okay, over the king, and he would deliver them into the hand, deliver them up to Lahontai's hands if he would make Amalekiah the second leader over the whole army. Amalekiah is so sick. He says, Lahontai, bring your army down and you will be the leader of your little army and my army. You'll be in charge. Lahontai, you will still be in charge and I'll be second in command. Okay, guys, what happened when the first in command get killed? Everyone fails. The second in command. Okay, so do we see Amalekiah's trickery already? He says, but, Amal but Lahanta, you will be in charge. You will be in charge. I'll just be second in command. I'll give you all the God and then you're going to be um, leader over. Okay? So, okay, look in verse 15. It came to pass when they saw that they were surrounded, they pled with Amalekiah that he would suffer them to fall in with their brethren that they may not be destroyed. Now this is the very thing which Malachi desired. It came to pass that he delivered his men contrary to the commands of the king. Now this is the thing that Malachi desired that he might accomplish his design in dethroning the king. Now look here in verse um, 17. It was a custom among the Lamanites that the chief leader was killed to appoint the second leader to be their chief leader. Okay. So we have a Lahontai being the chief leader over his men and Amalekiah's men, and Amalekiah being the second in command. Now, verse, oh my gosh, this is just so sad to read verse 18. Go ahead, would you read huh? that for us, David, verse 18? Came to pass that Amalekiah caused that one of his servants should administer poison by degrees to Lahontai that he died. Go ahead and read the next right. Now when Lahontai was dead, the Lamanites appointed Amalekiah to be their leader and their chief commander. And so okay. Lahontai died and for that Amalekiah was the leader. So uh, initially Amalekiah wanted the poison to be drunken by Lahontai. Because what's his goal? To is be, to be king over all the Lamanites. And so Lahontai is the guy at the top of the mountain that wouldn't come down. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. But then does he come down? Um, he just yeah. comes down a little bit. Yeah. He just won't don't do that. Yeah. Okay. So when I say don't come down from the mountain, don't come down from the mountain. Okay. Yeah, I'd be afraid. Don't come down even just a little bit. Because there are Amalekias all over the world. Okay. There are Amalekias everywhere trying to get you to come down off that mountain and just a little bit so Lahontai so was a good guy poison you by degrees. I, I can't really tell so Lahontai was a good man right? uh -huh. he's still a Lamanite but yeah. he did not want to go to battle yeah that's what I was saying okay. he was half so he's half. good that way okay yeah. and then Amalekiah who wants to be the king gets his army you know takes his army and he said okay we'll join with Lahontai's army but Lahontai, you'll be the, the chief captain over both of these armies, okay? And I'll just be second in command, okay? Do we see the problem? Okay, keep your finger right here, and let's go to 2 Nephi 28, verse 21. It's on page 109. 